everyone, Nitaro Rota here. I'll bring you our next episode of Wap Frame 101. In our last episode, we discussed how to get most credits. In this one, we're going to go over a very specific resource because ever since they decided to change how planets work and everything, a lot of people have been having a problem with one of the core components, which is plastids. Now, the first instance of plastids you get is on Phobos. Believe it or not. See, here you go. There's plastids, Morphix, Rubido, and Alloy Plate. This is your first instance, but not necessarily your best instance. But if you do want some early plastids, Stickney, which is the survival for the Corpus. They're extremely low level, so that means you'll be able to get to 10-15 minutes easy no matter what level you are. So no matter what, you're going to walk away with some plastids here. However, because of the common drop alloy plates, you might walk away with more alloy than plastids. Your next instance of plastids is all the way over on Saturn. Now, the thing about Saturn is this is where you can get Oricon cells as well. So if you need plastids or Oricon cells, and you just kind of sped through the planets, here's a good farm for you. The best farm spot you would want to do is Titan. Ignore the nightmare thing. I just completed, uh, I have just completed Saturn, so don't ignore that. As you can see here, regular mission survival Grenier. And you won't have to worry about it too much. Plus, this is a great affinity farm. Keep that in mind. However, the best plastid farm I have ever found is on Uranus, specifically Ophelia, because again, survival, but if you bring a Necros here, you will not only get plastids, but polymer bundles. I almost said the inside joke between me and my friends there. If you heard me slur there, I apologize, but I wanted to say polymer bundaroos, all right? The reason why this is the best plastid farm is because there's no common drops here. There's no alloy plate, there's no ferrite, there's no salvage, there's none of it. All it is is plastids, polymer, the rare resource gallium, and even rarer resource tellurium, and detonite ampules. If you bring a necros or a hydroid that has pilfering swarm or any type of double drops, just increase loot chance, even if you buy a resource drop booster, you will easily walk away with 1,200 plastids and nearly 5,000 polymer. Or 2,500 plastids, whatever. You will walk away with four digit plastids and four digit polymer. And just so you know, you'll need the polymer. It goes in every fucking thing. It's like the credits. But again, Phobos is the very first ch chance you get for plastids, but you will not get very many of them, sad to say. But you can get at least around, I would want to say, 400 a run for 10 to 15 minutes. The next one is Saturn, because the higher the level, the better the drop chance. That's generally how it actually goes. They decided to put that, in, that little thing in there, and you want to go to Titan, and no matter what you will walk away with quite a bit of plastids. Yes, you'll run into nanospores, however, plastids will be on their nodes. Like, it'll be a node resource more often than not for whatever reason on Saturn. And then Uranus is the epitome of what it means to be in farm frame. Polymer and plastids and tellurium. They're all in this planet node, specifically right here. Just get a resource drop chance and you'll walk away a happy frame. I know, relatively short video on how to actually get this crap, but what we're going to do here is I'm going to cut it right here, and I'm going to actually show you the difference between staying for 10-15 minutes and so on and so forth. And I'm only going to be using uh, Hydroid's Pilfering Swarm because it's the easiest one and you don't have to wait as long because Necros with Desecrate and all that other stuff just requires a whole new build that just... <sighs> so, here's a cut. I, will ho I hope you guys enjoy this, and I hope to see you in the next part. Please, if you have any questions, leave them down below in the comments, and I will answer them as soon as possible. Take care, everyone, and be safe. Later! Tenno, prepare for life support.